Hello everybody, welcome back to my channel, Life with Patty. And so, this morning I am going to start something new. I'm going to try very hard every Saturday to do a shout out Saturday. Because I watch so many incredibly wonderful channels and I would like to share with you, you know, some of you watch the same channels I do, but there's a lot of you that may not. And we're all here to help each other try to grow and support each other and so what I'm gonna do is every Saturday I'm gonna shout out five people okay and so if you don't get shouted out this time please don't get upset with me um, because I'm just gonna continue to shout out people every single Saturday okay next thing I want to tell you was I wasn't able to get a video with my sons and me um, and they kind of even mentioned that they'd like to do one with me, but we literally, it was a whirlwind. My son came in and he came out. So he um, just came to get his cousin and head back home. So he was only here one full day. So it was like, we didn't really have, well, two full days, but I had to work. And um, so I had one day off and he didn't get here till late. Everybody came in, we had dinner. And then the next day, and the next day he was busy with a full schedule so no he was only here one full day yeah anyways so he's coming back for Thanksgiving and hopefully at that time we can get all the boys to do a video with me okay so I'm gonna do my shout outs first and then I'm also have a bonus question that a subscriber asked me to ask the subbies because she liked my question about do you wash your clothes before you wear them and do you wear your pants more than one time before you wash them again. So we have a, another bonus question after my shout outs, okay? All right, so my first shout out is to a channel called Bon Bon Hauls and um, I love to watch her. She does tons of Dollar Tree hauls and she does a lot of DIY projects. And all her DIY projects look so easy, but so cute that I just want to try them out. <laughs> so, um, anyways, go and visit Bon Bon Halls and tell her that Patty sent you from Life with Patty. Some of the channels I may have shouted out once before. I'm going to shout them out again if I feel like, you know. And now I'm keeping a list. I'm keeping a little list over to the side so that the next time I don't shout them out again until I've shouted out everybody. And then I'll do re-shout outs. And so I know I have shouted out Tony before, but Creative Chica Halls, if uh, you are not subscribed to her channel, head on over. Her name is Tony. She is so nice. Sometimes she'll just have chats with you. Just have a chat. Um, and she does a lot of hauls, a lot of Dollar Tree hauls, Walmart hauls, different hauls, Michaels. Um, she started to do little home tours where she shows you um, like everything in her kitchen and how she's decorated her house is like a little museum is how I feel like she loves cactuses and sugar skulls and all kinds of different stuff and she's a collector and I love that kind of stuff I love watching houses that have collective stuff in it so um, I love her little tours um, she has chickens in the backyard. She'll take you to see her chickens. And during the hurricane, because she lived in Florida, she went to stay at her son's house in North Carolina. So we got to meet her daughter-in-law. And um, she's just a very nice, all-around sweet gal. Creative Chica Halls. Tell Tony that Life with Patty sent you. Um, the next one, I'm pretty new to her channel, and I think she's a fairly new channel. It's Dia's Frugal Life. She does a lot of inexpensive meals that she shares with you. Um, she does a lot of cooking videos. Most of them are budget friendly, where she's showing you um, how she makes um, a meal for a dollar. I'm not sure how many that serves. Um, she does a lot of what's for dinners. It's Dia's Frugal Life. Tell her that Life with Patty sent you. And I think she's just, I think actually she's under 200 subs. So she's brand new, so give her some love. Okay, the next one. Everything Marmy. 
Well, now this woman has to be the sweetest thing that you will ever meet in your entire life. <laughs> Her name is Mel, and she's so soft-spoken. She has the hugest heart you would ever come across. She's just so sweet. She is from Canada. She does a lot of hauls. Um, she's very crafty, and she's intrigued by watching other crafters. So if you're a crafter, go visit her and share with her. She loves for people to share their craftiness. She is an author, she, so she writes at home. I haven't asked her yet what she writes, if it's children's books or novels or, or what it is. But go check out Mel, Everything Marmy. She's so sweet. She's so sweet. I just love her. Um, we just seem to be connecting more and more as we get to know each other. And we have a lot of things in common. I got, she let everybody, as she did a video, how I became a marmy. I thought that was so sweet. So that's what, that must be what her grandkids call her. But it was adorable. And the last one I'm shouting out today is another wonderful, wonderful woman that seems to have just a big heart. And it is fabulous Fatima. She is, um, she's so sweet and she does a lot of hauls, a lot of DIYs. She does some taste test um, videos and she's a school bus driver and she did one of her hauls on her break on her bus and she was even saying she might give some of her little trinkets that she got at the Dollar Tree to her students that ride the bus. And I just think that she has a wonderful heart and um, yeah, I just, I bought a waffle maker because of her. One of those little waffle makers. Because <laughs> she, she did a video on it, and I was like, hey, I, I need one of those in my life. <laughs> so, anyways, go check out Fabulous Fatima. Tell her that Life with Patty sent you. Wonderful woman. I mean, she has such a great heart. Like, she goes to the Dollar Tree, and if she, she goes there quite often. And she knows that if you're really looking for something and you want it, she's like, oh, I'll try to look for it for you. Like, that's okay. It's posted from where you live to where I live would be outrageous. But that's what kind of a heart she has. Very big heart. Very nice person. Okay. So, my bonus question today is one of my subscribers, um, she loved my question about, like I said, about the, do you wash your clothes before you wear them when, they're, when you buy them when they're brand new? Do you wear your clothes more than once, um, like your jeans, before you wash them? So, her question was, what about your bath towels? Do you use a bath towel more than once or do you only use it once and throw it into the laundry? Now, I'll have to tell you my routine on this. A lot of people will say, oh, I use it several times because when you get out of the shower, you're clean. And I don't know, but this is my thing. I have a towel hanging up on the rack. And then when I'm gonna go take my shower for the day, um, I will get another towel out of the laundry, I mean, out of the linen closet. So the towel that I put, that I take out of the linen closet, I put on the shelf in the bathroom. Okay, so when I get out of the shower, the towel that's hanging up, I use on my head. And the towel that I got out new, I use on my body. And so then I go get dressed, and I've got my towel wrapped around my hair, and I got the other towel wrapped around me. I go get dressed. The towel that was wrapped around me, I then put it up to dry and hang up. The towel that was on my head goes in the laundry. So then the next day you see the towel that I used on my body then becomes my head towel. Does that make sense? So that's what I do. So I'll use it one day on my body, then one day on my head, then into the laundry it goes. So what do you guys do? Do you use your bath towels only once? And some people only use, some people have short hair, some people have long hair. So um, do you only use one towel or do you use two? Because I always use two towels. And um, a lot of people will take a shower, dry off their hair, and then dry off their body. So, inquiry of mind, want to know, what do you do? I thought that was a great question. If anybody else has some bonus questions that they would like me to ask on my videos, put them in the comments and I will uh, ask them. So, 
the bonus question answer the bonus question about the town situation if you have any bonus questions you would like me to ask also put that in the comments all right you guys you have a great day i hope that you'll go check out those five wonderful channels that i shouted out this morning and i will talk to you again tomorrow bye bye